Hello everyone, ready for a quick math challenge? Let's see if you can get this one right. The problem is 10 divided by 4, all divided by 3 times 5. You answer choices are A1 over 6, B3, C5 and D8. Take a moment to look at it carefully and think it through. Got your answer? Drop it in the comments below. Great, let's dive in and see if you got it right. Alright, the key to solving this problem is following the correct order of operations and simplifying step by step. Before we start dividing, let's rewrite the expression in a simpler form. We have 10 divided by 4, all divided by 3 times 5. First, let's simplify the denominator. In the denominator, we have 3 times 5, multiplying them gives us 15. So the expression now looks like this. Now let's rewrite 10 divided by 4 as a fraction. 10 divided by 4 is the same as writing it as a fraction 10 over 4. At this point we are dividing by 15. But remember dividing by a number is the same as multiplying by its reciprocal. That just means preferring the number upside down. So instead of dividing by 15 we will multiply by 1 over 15. But before we do that, let's simplify 10 over 4 first. Both 10 and 4 can be divided by 2. So 10 divided by 2 is equal to 5. 4 divided by 2 is equal to 2. So now our expression is 5 over 2 times 1 over 15. But wait, before we multiply, let's see if we can simplify even more. We notice that 5 in the numerator and 15 in the denominator share a common factor of 5. So let's divide both by 5. 5 divided by 5 is equal to 1, 15 divided by 5 is equal to 3. Now our expression simplifies further to 1 over 2 times 1 over 3. Since everything is fully simplified, we are ready for the final step, multiplication. Multiplying the numerators, 1 times 1 is equal to 1. Multiplying the denominators, 2 times 3 is equal to 6. So the simplified result is 1 over 6. And there you have it. The correct answer is A106. So did you get the right answer? If you did, awesome job. But if you made a mistake, no worries. Now you know exactly how to tackle problems like this. If you enjoyed this challenge, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. So you never miss out on more fun math problems. Catch you in the next one.